So you want to install MetaTrader 4 on Mac OS? You're in the right place. In this video, I will show you how to install MetaTrader 4 on your Mac OS. Whether you're using Mac OS Sonoma, Ventura, Monterey, Big Sur, or Catalina, this guide will work. First, open your preferred web browser. In this example, I'm using Brave. Next, type MetaTrader 4 in the address bar and hit Enter. In the search results, click on the first link. You should be redirected to the official website of MetaTrader. I will leave the page link in the description of the video. Next, select MetaTrader 4 on the download section. Click the X icon button and save the file to your desired location. The download should start immediately. It may take a few moments, so just wait for it to complete. Once it's finished, locate the downloaded file and double-click it to extract the contents. After extraction, you'll see a file named metatrader4.pkg. Double-click this file. If you see a warning message that says metatrader 4.0 kg can't be opened because it was not downloaded from the App Store, click OK. To bypass this, go to System Settings, then click Privacy and Security on the left. Scroll down to the Security section. You should see a message that says MetaTrader 4 was blocked from use because it is not from an identified developer. Click Open Anyway and enter your security password if prompted. Click Open again to confirm. The MetaTrader 4 installation wizard will open. Click Continue. Click Continue again, then click Agree to accept the license agreement. Finally, click Install and enter your security password if prompted, then click Install Software. Once the installation is complete, close the installer. The application should now launch automatically. If it doesn't, open your Applications folder, find MetaTrader 4, and double-click the icon to launch it. You may be prompted to accept the license agreement again. Click Agree to proceed. Congratulations! You've successfully installed MetaTrader 4 on your Mac, and you're ready to start your trading journey. Thanks for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more tutorials and tips. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below and I'll be happy to help.